Have you not had your fill of Hillary and Bill? The two-headed carnival show known as the Clintons <laughs> kick off their speaking tour in Canada. <laughs> where they had nothing but great things to say about the country and its leadership. I'm kidding, they ripped Trump a lot. And they sat in these weird boxy chairs. Those chairs don't look comfortable at all. Meanwhile, the same night, Obama was at an event in Houston where he's sitting in a huge chair. Look how great those big, wow. <laughs> comfy cha Texas chairs. Wow. Nice high back, good for the posture. But the Clintons, they get chairs with no back. <laughs> no posture. You know, that's got to piss the Clintons off. Also, hardly anyone was there to see the Clintons. The venue, I know. Bad. Yeah, the a venue could seat 19,000, but they sold only 3,300 tickets. So I don't know what's worse, that they only sold 3,300 tickets out of 19,000, or that they actually sold 3,300 <laughs> tickets. Down upside down, Greg. Yes, um, yeah. So why the weak turnout? Perhaps they aren't selling the thing hard enough. I think we could, with a few marketing tweaks, they'd fill the house. Take a look. Emails, emails, emails. Get ready to be annihilated as the king and queen of Chappaqua proudly present the We promise we're not doing this because we're broke tour extravaganza. Live from a half-empty arena, it's the Thrilla of Hilla and Billa. Featuring your favorite failed candidate, Hillary the Iron Rod and Bill the Hound Dog, c c c Clinton. This isn't your grandfather's in his open robe speaking tour. We've got non-stop epic sex play. Secret servants agents smash blackberries with sledgehammers. Plus, softball questions, unlimited cigars, Tony Hawk, Ethan Hawk, and 50,000 real life hawks. And don't miss the world's only evil laughter tutorial. <laughs> and the first 100 to arrive receive an authentic stained blue dress. So get your tickets now for the low price of free. It's the We Promise We're Not Doing This Because We're Broke to Our Extravaganza. You know, uh, Mike. Yeah. I think it's I think it's going to be good to see Bill up on stage because that means all the husbands in the audience know where he is. Yes. <laughs> first of all, first of all, two-headed carnival show. You can just <laughs> shut the show down right now. Yeah. We're, we're not we're not topping that. But it, this flies in the face of the, the fact that people. Before think, you read that, there's I'm, children in the audience. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> this is this uh, to, to prove Don't a point. Uh, yeah, I do actually Ear do muffs. some research. All right. That's what this Go is. Go for it. Go okay. For it. Uh, this is an actual quote from yeah. Hillary uh, during the course of this presentation up in Canada. She's in Canada, a foreign country, right? Yes. <clears throat> she says, and she's talking about uh, Saudi Arabia. She's talking about uh, the crown prince. We have a president, she says, meaning Trump, of course, right. who was thank part of the cover-up, thank you, uh, was part of the cover-up as to what happened in that consulate or embassy when Mr. Khashoggi was murdered. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I want you to think about this. Yeah, someone someone got right to the point there. Think about how, with a lack of self awareness, mm. and she's up there, and she's basically just accusing our president in a foreign country mm -hmm. of a, a, a cover up of a horrible murder. Mm -hmm. And that's what and that's what uh, I wanted to read, and now I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, do you have anything? To, do you have anything to read, Terry? <laughs> Nothing to read, but you know, I have a, obviously a, a very visceral dislike of Hillary Clinton for the reason that, as a Green Beret, I, I, I had to use secure emails when I was talking to embassy of places I was going. She walked away. She should be in jail because if... if, if, if oh, yeah. it, 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 that's not... I, you went for that line, dude. You, that you, was went, for that, you went for that applause line. It was line. low hanging fruit, but I actually didn't intend that. My point is, if I had done what Hillary had done, I'd lose my security clearance, lose my team... Actually, I'm pr probably good at Leavenworth. So the fact that she's lose your out, leather pants. No, nah, never lose. <laughs> never lose the leather pants. No one's taken. I, but but I have to say this. When I see this, I actually this is the first time, really the first time I've actually pitied them mm -hmm. because I feel like there's that's the low they've reached. Like they're really doing a tour. Yeah. I don't. For yeah. You don't feel bad. No. Can I do one quick thing? My mom loves Greg more than me, and this is your Christmas present: a, a unicorn pen. Oh, I thank you. That's from my mom. All right. Uh, that's yeah. sweet. Operating under a budget. All right. Can I just no, try wait, 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 an experiment? Just Mike, an experiment. Mike, what okay. are you going to read? I'm now? just going to try an experiment. <clears throat> uh, I, here we go. She should be in jail. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, All right. See. Thanks, so, Mike. Tyrus, yeah. I think what they need, what uh, Bill and Hillary need, is an opening band, which is what Bill calls the belt around his pants. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> well played, sir. Hey, well hey, played. Hey, hey, Greg. Yes. <laughs> remember, remember when you brought everybody together? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. It's, it's, it's over. <laughs> it's back. I know. I'm sorry. No, you know what? Listen, uh, wrestling is kind of like what they're going through. Right. You wrestle in the WWE. There's mm -hmm. 75,000 people chanting your name. It's an amazing thing. Yeah. You leave the WWE and you think, I'm good. <laughs> Because all those people cheered for me. Yeah. They stayed with the WWE. Yeah. They go with the winner. Mm -hmm. And you're wrestling in Indiana with six people going, yeah, brothers Clay, <laughs> Woo, yeah. <laughs> Do that one trick, sir. I'm trying to work. Like, it's, yeah. it's literally when it's over, it's over. Right. And I think this was probably the best video mm -hmm. that the Democratic Party has to offer. Yeah. The next time she goes, you know what I'm thinking about? Run. Run the tape. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You yeah, have yeah. a thousand cousins in there. <laughs> like, literally eight people showed up to your event. Yes. Yeah. And it also shows you what happens when you don't have influence anymore. Mm -hmm. Because it used to be, what was it, half a mil? Yeah, yeah, To yeah. hear Bill? Yeah. Yeah. Now you can't get seven, eight people to stay in the show. That was in the beginning. That was like right after the pyro. Yeah. <laughs> they, it's true. they were dumping tickets on StubHub. Yeah, yeah. they yeah. were. Oh, yeah. my God. So, Kat, is there any entertainment value to this? Any? No. no. I don't think so. I'm personally find it disgusting that Bill Clinton is able to actually make any money at all giving speeches, mm -hmm. given the fact that more than a dozen women, yeah. more, not, not like one or two, but more than a dozen women have accused him of sexual assault or of sexual misconduct, mm -hmm. and we're living in this Me Too era, and yet he's able to go out there and speak, and some of these same Democrats who say that they're champions for women and that they, you know, believe all victims are going to go out and support Bill Clinton when he has all these accusations up against him. Mm -hmm. How is he able to do that? He should be a pariah, not a personality and a speaker. Mm -hmm. He needs to go away forever. Oh, all right. Hey, you got to top that one. <laughs> yeah. Talk yeah. about fair. I think, I think for the, the applause line fishing, she beat you, Mike Baker. She, yeah. she kicked me right in yeah, the pants. I heard, and she had a real point, too. Yeah. Unlike yeah. you. I got I to get my shoe out of there.